Today we get to do our best Darth Maul in the Fractured Duality in Star Wars Jedi Survivor. What's up, YouTube Zero here, and today I have the Fractured Duality, where you have to defeat all enemies with the double-bladed lightsaber in Star Wars Jedi Survivor. In this video, I'll show you the challenge, and then at the end of the video, I will show you where it's located in Star Wars Jedi Survivor. Now, the first round is just going to be a Stormtrooper firing off one of his shielded machine guns. Not too bad. The next round is going to be a little bit tougher. More enemies are going to come. There's going to be more enemies with that machine gun. There's also going to be a couple of shielded enemies. I do love this double-bladed stance. It's one of my favorites because of how fast it is. Now, I am, when I utilize the double-bladed stance, less defensive than I probably should be. So you'll see me just kind of flying around. Not blocking as much except when those machine gun stormtroopers are on the battlefield because I do want to block their shots. But I'm just flying around. I do have a decent amount of points invested in that double bladed stance, which does allow me to utilize a couple of moves in this fractured duality. If you don't have any investment points in your double blade, it's going to make it a little bit harder. So you may want to invest a couple in your double blade prior to going into this fractured challenge. You can see one of the moves actually that I invested in is you hold L1, at least for the PlayStation and click square and you fly forward with a spinning saber. I utilize that a lot. It does use force, but it is a fantastic move for the double bladed saver helps you close the distance on enemies as well as dealing a decent amount of damage that's one i recommend getting if you love the double bladed stance it's one of my favorites you can fly around the battlefield as you see me doing not only against hordes of enemies but also against bosses it's great so you can close the distance and not have to worry too much about staying far away and then having to close the distance on bosses. Some of the other lightsaber stances makes it a little bit harder to close distances on bosses, the double bladed. It's very well rounded. You can utilize it in a lot of situations, whether for multiple enemies or big bosses. This fractured duality doesn't have a lot of huge enemies there are pretty quick enemies and a lot of enemies that shoot at you but it's not too bad we have completed this fractured duality let's see where it is on the map taking a look at the map we are going to be on koba and this is going to be really close to home if you haven't gotten here yet it's actually right near our cantina garden right near the mantis on top of our saloon, our cantina that we go to all of the time. Right on Koba, right in Ramblers Outreach. If you're on top of the building and you're in your garden, go towards that tower in the back and start climbing. Keep going all the way up, climb all the way up to the top. I know I missed this when I first started looking around on top of my garden. Keep going all the way up to the top and the forced tear will be right in front of you as soon as you get up. So I hope you enjoyed this video and if you did, feel free to give it a thumbs up and hit that subscribe button. Till next time, may the force be with you. Peace.